So we just talked about finances. Well, once you get those finances in order, one of your New Year's resolutions may be to take a trip and relax. Here with more from Alabama World Travel is our certified travel industry expert, Jennifer Booth. Jennifer, thanks so much for joining us here on Alabama Live. A lot of people do start off the new year and they say, I want to take a, maybe a big vacation for some. It may be a smaller vacation. Correct. What are some of those destinations that people are already calling you about for this year? Oh my gracious, we've got a lot of Europe that is always popular, but we're also getting beyond. So it might be Thailand, it might be Galapagos, it might be Alaska is on fire this year and booking up more quickly than we've ever seen. So, are and then people, Caribbean is always big. Are people looking for resorts, cruises, or a combination? combination and I think COVID put everyone in a state of can't, can't, can't and now they want to they do want, what they, they want could. to go places. And they've saved up for it. So they are finding they want the time and they want the trip to be meaningful. What are some misconceptions that people have when it comes to maybe traveling abroad or even hiring someone to help them? What are some concerns yes. people have when they call you? Um, well, first of all, they think they can do it all on the internet themselves. <laughs> and in some cases they can. You know, there are some trips that you can do that. But um, when they do it on their own, you know, there's a little saying, when you're on your own, you're on your own. And the world is changing so quickly. For example, there is a strike down in Peru right now. If you are booked on a trip there and you book this on your own, what are your resources? What's your recourse at that point? Well, we're there to manage all that and maybe even because we've got people on the ground in Peru to say, hey, there's talk on the ground that a strike is coming. You, we're gonna you reroute you. You may need to go somewhere else. That's right. So a lot of it is that I don't need a travel agency. Um, another is that it's gonna be way too much and I will say we do charge for our services, that's how we stay in business, but it's one of those you get what you pay for also, so we're adding value. Um, like we might save you 4000 on a particular trip and our fee is not going to be anywhere near that, but we know what the specials are, we see this every day. And then if one of the different cruise lines is marketing to you, um, it's like I want that cruise, and it's like okay, You've told me all about you, and that cruise doesn't really fit with what you, what what you, you said want. you wanted. So you don't know what you don't know sometimes. Yeah, maybe in your mind, you may think this is one thing, but you all are the experts. You've had clients go there. You've been there yourself, and you can tell that person, you know, you said you want to relax. This is, this is more for the people who are nature people or outdoors people or vice versa. Right, and transparently, I'm not going to use a travel advisor every time in my own life. I've got a trip down to the Gulf. I don't need one for that. But when your trip really matters in that time and you are hoping to bond with your family or relax from a high stress job, that's when you want to use that travel advisor. Now you made a good comment. You said, if I'm going to maybe the beach in our state, I don't hire someone. For someone who's booking abroad, especially for the first time, yes. how important is it to hire an expert? We would highly recommend it. Again, you don't know, but also help with all of those logistics, the passport, the customs. entry requirements, customs, what you're going to expect. If you need a meet and greet, if the people have any mobility issues, we can have someone meet them at the airport. And then, too, there are some countries that are a little bit more friendly to, to Americans. Americans than others. And if we can help you find the right place, then you're going to enjoy that first trip because. It's like when someone starts at kindergarten, if they have a bad experience. They're, they may never go again. Correct. They're, or they're, they're going to hate school. Yes. <laughs> They'll say, I don't travel abroad. I had a bad experience. I'm just going to stay where I'm Correct. I yes. How can people get in touch with you, your office, if they do want to go ahead Thank and book? Thank you. So our phone number, 334-279-8720, or on our website, Alabama, um, excuse me, awtinc.com. Or they said they can stop right by your office here. In oh, Montgomery, absolutely. Right off Taylor Road. Correct. We, not far from East Chase. We talked about it right That's before right. We are right between Vaughn Road and East Chase. So so they are very easy to find. Jennifer, thanks so much for joining us Thank here you, on Jasmine. Alabama Live. We appreciate it.